Hey, how's it going, guys? And welcome back to yet another episode of our Tokyo Ghoul Dark War. And today is going to be a little bit of an update, as you can probably tell from the title. We have had news, which I received last night, actually, after posting the last video. I actually had an email from Game Samurai saying, Hey, we've got a new update coming out tomorrow, so let me get that up for you. Here we go. Let's have a look at what is going on. So here is the web version on the Game Samba forums, which you guys can go and check out. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to read more. But there is an update coming to the Android servers. Unfortunately for me, I play iOS, so I'm probably gonna have to wait about a week. Hopefully not that long. I'd like to think less than that, but it's probably gonna be about a week um, if it's anything to go off the last update, but I know there were complications in the last one So let's hope that it's only a few days, but today There's gonna be some updates on the Android and these are what they have been said So the maintenance is for four hours long um, That I don't know if that's going on at the time being it does say 12 a.m Which is not yet if it's the in the in-game time it's got about another two hours from recording this video so it's gonna be down it's a eh. no actually it should have already happened so the update should have already happened apparently so that is interesting let me know if it has happened by the time this video comes out i'd like to know since i don't have an android device i can actually go on and check that out but Let's look at some of the things that have been mentioned in the update. So we've got the update here. I'm hoping, I'm hoping for a couple new SSRs. So we've got some new heroes here. So we've got Katero Amon, and that's his door blades. That would be a cool SSR if that's going to be an SSR. Probably a, uh, I feel like he's going to be a DPS, the Amon blades. But if he's a, if he's a tank like his Kura, then that could be pretty cool. We've got uh, Take Hakuro in his suit form. Potentially an SSR? I feel like it would be more an SR. We have an R version of him. I'd like to see more than just SSRs released into the game. I know people would think, oh, there's the worst point in those. We've got all these such good characters. But I feel like everyone's just hunting for these SRs. It uh, this SSRs. I feel like it would be a nice little addition to add a few extra rarity characters um so we've got take hakuro in his suit and then we've got toka kirishima ken Kaneki, and also hinami freguchi in their you i always mispronounce this and you know what my english is like when it comes to japanese pronunciations but we've got the yuka yukata pretty sure that's how it said yukata um which those will be very interesting to see I would like to see an SSR Hinami. So if that's the SSR Hinami, that could be pretty damn cool. That could be pretty damn cool. So those are the new heroes which are coming into the game. Uh, we've got a brand new system, which is the Faction Restriction System. Very interesting. I'm really interested to see how this works. Because a faction, it sounds a little bit like the organization that we already have. But I bet you it's nothing like it. It sounds like it. Organization, faction. That's going to be pretty cool. If it's anything like... What's it called? Anything like Rebirth. Well, it's going to be called Rebirth, the UK version. Or the, you, you know what I'm saying. The English version is going to be Rebirth. Conveniently named after a series of mine. Um, we've got Reinvoked. If it's anything like their battling system, that could be pretty cool. You know, the, the faction, the wars. That could be pretty cool. Uh, we've got the new feature here, which is going to be Tokyo Search, which I believe I've seen people talking about this doing to do with RC cells. So maybe there's going to be a new RC cell feature. That could be pretty cool. I feel like that could be a thing because I'll talk about it again in a minute because we are about to get to it. But there is a feature with new, S, uh, new RC cell types. So that could be pretty cool if that is something to do with that. We've got a new event, which is going to be Treasure Rush. This is probably going to look for... What's this is going to look... I feel like it's going to be similar to, like, the gold and the XP pots that we've got already, in, you know, during... What's it called? The, da the daily events. I feel like it's going to be something somewhat similar to that. 
and it gives you rewards of some kind. This is just me speculating. I have no idea. But that could be pretty cool. We've got new equipment and new RC cell type. We've got the champion Arata and we've also got the mystic Arata set respectively for champion equipment. Well, the new equipment and also the RC cell type. This is where I feel like these new RCs could be something to do with the Tokyo Search, potentially. Potentially. I know people were speculating that the Tokyo Search was about RC cells. Whether that's true or not is yet to be discovered. Uh, we've got new gems. We've got the Mythic, which sounds really weird to say. We've got the Mythic cells. Uh, I read the underneath. Gems. Um, still learning the gem system. It's really... I don't know. I don't know what I think about the gem system at the moment. We've got uh, add an effect and display interface for RC cells. That's pretty cool. And then it also has passive skills activated uh, by refining RC cells. That's really interesting. That's really interesting. Using RC cells to activate passive skills. Thinking emoji. That could be really cool. Uh, we've got optimize the seven day login events and interface. So that's going to be obviously new servers that come out. They're going to have the seven day login thing where you get a new reward at the end. Um, so that's going to look a bit better and hopefully it's a little bit easier for new players. Um, we've got new, we've got the optimize the festival events interface. So it's going to have a whole, whole new lift. And it's got passive skills activated by refining RC cells. No, I've just read the same thing twice. Ignore me. Um, new types of events. New types of events. That is what everybody's been waiting for. I know these festivals are pretty cool and whatnot, and you're getting all these SSRs. I've got a few, a fair few of them myself because of it. But I feel like the the actual challenges, the event himself, uh, they're a little bit stale. So I'm happy to see... They're listening to the fact that we want these different events. You know, doing the same events every single time for these festivals. It's a little bit... It kind of wants a lot of gems, I've noticed. A lot of gems. And it's really hard for some people to get hold of these gems. So, yeah. Um, we've got optimized the server selection interface. So, obviously, when you're loading in, you can select the menu. Apparently, that's all going to get a relift. We've got optimized VIP draw interface. Okay, so it looks like the VIP draw is getting a, a bit of a facelift. Um, draw, uh, draw a card to receive extra item rewards. So it looks like you're going to get something a little bit extra when you do these VIP draws, which I can kind of understand, even though getting these SR shards and whatnot from the VIP draw, if you don't pull an SSR shard, then I like it. It's like another way to, you know, build up your fame. Um, but an extra reward can't hurt. And then we've got adjust the world boss rewards and lower the requirement to obtain daily repoint rewards. So that's going to be talking about ghoul expulsion. So I feel like ghoul expulsion is probably going to have a, a different way of everyone playing it. Um, I know for a fact, if this is true, we're going to have to jump on ghoul expulsion as soon as it comes out. Because that's going to be really interesting. And it looks like those rewards are going to be a little bit easier to get. So, we'll have a see. I am one of the top damages on my server, along with a couple others. So, definitely going to benefit those who are further along than the others. That's for sure. Well, that is everything on the update. I just wanted to make sure everyone was in the loop. It does say, remember, just, just to point her out, it does say the iOS servers will be launched another time. So, hopefully, within the week... I don't want a repeat of the last update where we waited two, nearly three weeks for an update. But hopefully there's no errors and we have a successful update. And we could play along with these new characters because that is what everyone is looking for right now. It's been two months since the last update. So let's hope this update comes through and it's let's just hope it's a good update but that's going to be it for today's update and i'll see you guys another day for some brand new tokyo ghoul dart war bye for now